Hey, I'm here for it, brother. I'll let your service. You see it. Um, back for a quick little workshop. I'm out here in the sun. Still about 54. You know, we had was up to about 76 the other day. <clears throat> but uh, it has got we had a little temperature drop overnight. So I'm gonna try to get through this with you. Uh, it's never mind the background. You know, uh, I take the time out when I could take the time out, and right now I got time. So, um, let's pray. The Heavenly Father, Lord God, I ask that you show mercy, Lord God. Let this word be a blessing to the hearers, Lord God, and they be edifying, Lord God, in Jesus' name. Amen. So, um, let's deal with this with a, with a few thoughts here, all right? Um, we'll deal with it. Just, just, just one thought. Maybe not too much, right? Let's go to... Uh, First Peter. Yeah. First Peter chapter four, verses 11. It says, if any man, and I'm sorry, if any man speak, let him speak as the oracles of God. If any man minister, let him, let him do it as the ability which God given. Right. And. Um, that God in all things may be glorified through Jesus Christ to whom be praise and dominion forever and ever. Amen. How, how can we speak as an oracle of God if we won't prove all things? I'll wait. How can we speak as an oracle of God if we won't prove all things? How can we speak as an oracle of God, if we bear false witness, because we repeat things that have not been proven. That gets in the way of us being the oracle, right? Being the mouthpiece, right? Being able to channel the spirit of God to say what needs to be said um, at a time that it needs to be said. But how are we going to do that? If 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 we're not proving all things, right? How are we gonna do that if we, right? Because if right now you can think of a time where you repeated something that wasn't proven about somebody else. I know I have. I, I had to repent the other day just from talking about it. Like I've repeated things that I can't necessarily say is true. Right. And I didn't go to the source to get it. Now, there are times I've gone to the source and say, hey, cat, dog, mouse. I'm underneath the act. I'm hearing this. Right. That's true. Right. Because I know we in the bear false witness season. Right. Uh, uh, when they lie against you and say all manner of evil against you falsely for his name. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know I know we there. But how can I, am I getting in my own way of being an oracle of God? Because I lack the patience to prove all things? That's something to think about. But from, from this day forward, you know the scripture exists, right? We want to be oracles of God. But don't get in your way of God talking through you channeling his his spirit through you or direct word through you something new through you because you won't prove all things and because you're a tail bearer let's not give god any excuses not let's not give ourselves any excuses not to be oracles of god Something to chew on, you know. Something to chew on. Think about it. Brother Al, at your service. Oh, God.